Over 20 game developer teams competed in Game Dev Challenge 2018, conducted by Pandir in Yango on Sunday. Pandir have been organizing Game Dev Challenge annually since 2017 with the support of MCTC, Myanmar Creative Technology College, and Save in Your Brain Entertainment. It aims to promote game community, to create a platform for all game lovers and developers, as well as to tend out more game developers and high-quality games in the country. We see a lot of talent and from this challenge you see a lot of games being created. This year the challenge is bigger than last year. So we see an increase in the quality of the games that has been produced. The whole community is growing. So what I, I expect is that uh, everyone that participate actually learn a lot about games. So learning is a biggest goal, one of the biggest goals that we have. Mentors from Pandia, MCTC, and Safe in Your Brain and other professionals have been trained to the developers how to create a game since 1st December. Five people of each group have to create a prototype game within nine days in this challenge. This year, even in a 16 years old age youth joined this competition. Many university students also joined this year. We have planned to organize such kind of competition in the near future too. I think game developers need to go a long way to catch up international standards. <laughs> Our game, we Revenant of the Void, just got the winner. We are going to upgrade this game with a better quality for the users. We have plans to add many more games, levels, high quality graphic and others to our game. We faced many challenges and got many lessons through these nine days. By organizing such kind of competition, other developers like us can get many advantages like network and others. The winner will get a chance of publishing a game for the public with the support of Pandir, MCTC and Save in Your Brain.